Lanky with news and announcements for Maxville and St. John, Kansas on Cable Channel 3 and also on sandylandcenter.org. Today is Monday, the 3rd of October. It's 77 at noontime here in the square. <coughs> Today will be sunny with a high of 91 and that should be the high temperature for the week. Then uh, Tuesday, sunny and windy, uh, down a whole degree to 90. Wednesday, sunny and 83. Thursday, partly cloudy and windy with a temperature high of 80. And then for uh, Friday and Saturday, scattered thunderstorms. Uh, chance of rain both days, 40%. 76 the high uh, on Friday and 69 the high on Saturday. <coughs> and of course, I hope some of the rain actually does get here. And maybe it could get here a little early. That would be good. Well, we have no birthdays or anniversaries to announce. Uh, also, the county commission is meeting from this morning. Uh, we'll be after this 6.30 news uh, tonight. And then uh, tomorrow, city council live at 7 o'clock. And uh, also tonight, the, the USD 350 Board of Education is meeting 7 o'clock Monday night, and the meeting will be broadcast on Sunday at uh, 1 o'clock in the afternoon. <coughs> and that broadcast is sponsored by Farm Bureau of St. John. Then uh, an important announcement for everybody. Uh, Shepherd Center will be closed on Columbus Day, and that's uh, Monday the 10th. So you can remember 1010, and it's... Uh, Columbus Day, and will be closed. Now on Saturday, October 8th, the Wichita Model A Club will be visiting us with 35 or so Model A's that they'll park around the square. <coughs> and October 8th is a Saturday. Uh, it's sponsored by the Science Museum, and the Science Museum will be open. Uh, the Hall Museum will be open as well. And uh, the people there will came to see St. John and uh, look at our square and see what's around town, and particularly to visit the Science Museum. But they can also see the Hall Museum and anything else that happens to be open on, uh, on Saturday. <coughs> and uh, that will be nice because that should bring a lot of people in town. You've got the whole Model A Club coming. And then there ought to be at least twice as many people as that from around here that want to see all the Model A's. So while they're here looking at the town, we can inspect their Model A's. And uh, some people may never have seen a Model A, so this would be a good chance to come in on Saturday the 8th. <coughs> the Stafford County Health Department has flu shots for $20. And um, I heard from some medical people that they think we might have a, uh, a stronger flu this year. Although I've also heard that the flu vaccine that we've got is for last year's flu. So I, I'm not sure how that will work out. Most insurance uh, uh, cards will cover that. <coughs> $20 for the shot. And you can call 3504 to talk to the health department and see when somebody's going to be there that and give you your shot. Now Maxville is doing an exciting thing. Uh, they're going to uh, bury a time capsule. And that's seven, yeah, October 7 at 1, one o'clock in the afternoon. And then they'll be opening it in 2036. <coughs> So I wonder how many of us will be here in 2036 uh, to see that time capsule open. Anyway, items to be placed in the time capsule have to be received by October 6th. And you can bring them to the city office or to Janet Hudson. <coughs> so please place your items in plastic storage bags with the name on the outside uh, of who's donating it or the recipient, it says. If you have any questions, call Janet at 348-2595 or Julie at 348-2575.
to find out about the time capsule. <coughs> then we have uh, next the 25th annual turkey dinner at St. John Catholic Parish on the 16th, which is a Sunday, from 12 to 1.30 in the afternoon at the Catholic Wit Center. It's $8 for adults, uh, $5 for kindergarten through 6th grade, and under 5 is free. Then they have a, a raffle, and a first prize is a queen-sized quilt, and the drawing will be at 1.30. And I don't know if there's $100 cash goes with it, or if that's a second prize. But it would be nice to win either or both of those. So everyone uh, is welcome at the Catholic Wit Center for their 25th uh, turkey dinner. Uh, then uh, we have the United Methodist Bazaar, a <coughs> soup sandwich and pie for $6, and if you're a nine or under, uh, $3. And they have uh, that, soup sandwiches and pie. And they have homemade baked goods for sale, craft items, and other things. So, First United Methodist Church at 4.30 to 7 on October 19th. And uh, those are two events that we look forward to every year. <coughs> and uh, that's all the news that I probably have enough voice to, uh, to talk about. The word of the day is this. Uh, if at first you do succeed, try to hide your astonishment. This is Jim Lakey, hoping you have a great Monday and a great week.